Welcome to Wonderslate. Subscribe to our Telegram channel given in the description to updates and study materials. Topic for today's quiz is Information and Communication Technology, ICT, Set 5. Question number 1. Guid or Uid is a bit integer number used to identify resources. Option A. 128. Option B. 224. Option C. 142. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is Option A. 128. Guid or Uid is an acronym for Globally Unique Identifier or Universally Unique Identifier. It is a 128-bit integer number used to identify resources. The term GUID is generally used by developers working with Microsoft technologies, while UID is used everywhere else. Question number 2. How can you optimize performance of your computer? Option A. Delete unused files. Option B. Defrag disk. Option C. Scan for virus. Option D. All of above. The correct answer is Option D. All of above. 1. Clean up your hard disk. 2. Run the performance troubleshooter. 3. Uninstall and delete unused programs. 4. Limit programs at startup. 5. Defragment your hard disk. 6. Run fewer programs at a given time. 7. Run only one antivirus program. 8. Regularly restart your PC. Question number 3. A social networking service offered by Google Incorporated. Option A. Facebook. Option B. Google Plus. Option C. Twitter. Option D. Instagram. The correct answer is Option B. Google Plus. The Google Plus social network finally arrives. Google's long expected second shot at taking on Facebook in the social networking space has arrived in the form of the Google Plus project. It has some interesting twists on the social networking model. Question number 4 Ethical hackers who use their skill to secure the integrity of computer systems of networks is called Option A. Red Hat. Option B. White Hat. Option C. Green Hat. Option D. All the above. The correct answer is Option B. White Hat. An ethical hacker, also referred to as a white hat hacker, is an information security expert who systematically attempts to penetrate a computer system, network, application or other computing resource on behalf of its owners and with their permission to find security vulnerabilities that a malicious hacker could potentially exploit. Question number 5. Which of the following is a programming language for creating special programs like applets? Option A. Java. Option B. Domain name. Option C. .NET. Option D. None of the above. The correct answer is Option A. Java. An applet is a program that runs in a web browser. An applet can be a fully functional Java application because it has the entire Java API at its disposal. Question number 6. COBOL is widely used in underscore applications. Option A. Commercial. Option B. Scientific. Option C. Space. Option D. Mathematical. The correct answer is Option A. Commercial. COBOL, common business oriented language, was the first widely used high level programming language for business applications. Question number 7. Which of the following translator is slow in execution? Option A. Interpreter. Option B. Compiler. Option C. 
assembler option d none of it is the correct answer is option a interpreter computer language processor that translate a program line by line so it is slow in execution the interpreter transforms the high level program into an intermediate language that it then executes or it could pass the high level source code and then performs the commands directly which is done line by line or statement by statement question number 8 lisp is suitable for operations option a numeric option b arithmetic option c character option d both a and b the correct answer is option d both a and b lisp is used in artificial intelligence programs and it is suitable for both numeric and arithmetic operations question number 9 Where is the headquarters of Intel located? Option A. Redmond, Washington. Option B. Tucson, Arizona. Option C. Santa Clara, California. Option D. Richmond, Virginia. The correct answer is Option C. Santa Clara, California. Intel Corporation is an American multinational corporation and technology company headquartered in Santa Clara, California, in the Silicon Valley. Question number 10. Which among the following is not a security/privacy risk? Option A. Spam. Option B. Virus. Option C. Hacking. Option D. Phishing. The correct answer is option A spam irrelevant or unsolicited messages sent over the internet typically to a large number of users for the purposes of advertising phishing spreading malware etc question number 11 if a large business is going to use a single computer to execute many programs for hundreds of users at the same time performing relatively simple operations and transactions the type of computer will probably be a option a super computer option b personal computer option c mainframe option d isp the correct answer is option c mainframe mainframes are a type of computer that generally are known for their large size amount of storage processing power and high level of reliability they are primarily used by large organizations for mission critical applications requiring high volumes of data processing question number 12 i can stands for option a internet corporation for assigned names and numbers option b internet corporation for assigned nodes and numbers option c internet connection for assigned nodes and numbers option d all the above the correct answer is option a internet corporation for assigned names and numbers i can is the acronym for internet corporation for assigned names and numbers which is a non profit organization that is in charge of maintaining and coordinating the internet namely the internet protocol ip addresses and the domain name system dns question number 13 the do's and don'ts of online communication is called option a cyberspace option b netiquette option c none of the above option d all the above The correct answer is option B netiquette online etiquette/ slash netiquette is ingrained into culture although etiquette in technology is a fairly recent concept the rules of etiquette that apply when communicating over the internet or social networks or devices are different from those applied when communicating in person or by audio or video phone 
Question number 14. A device for converting handwritten impressions into coded characters and positional coordinates for input to a computer is Option A. Touch panel Option B. Mouse Option C. Wand Option D. Writing tablet The correct answer is Option D. Writing tablet A graphic tablet also known as a digitizer, drawing tablet, drawing pad, writing tablet, digital drawing tablet, pen tablet, or digital art board, is a computer input device that enables a user to hand draw images, animations and graphics, with a special pen-like stylus, similar to the way a person draws images with a pencil and paper. These tablets may also be used to capture data or handwritten signatures. It can also be used to trace an image from a piece of paper which is taped or otherwise secured to the tablet surface. Capturing data in this way, by tracing or entering the corners of linear poly lines or shapes, is called digitizing. Question number 15. Which protocol provide email facility among different hosts? Option A. FTP. Option B. SMTP. Option C. Telnet. Option D. SNMP. The correct answer is Option B. SMTP. SMTP, Simple Mail Transfer Protocol, is a TCP IP protocol used in sending and receiving email. However, since it is limited in its ability to queue messages at the receiving end, it is usually used with one of two other protocols. POP3 or IMAP that let the user save messages in a server mailbox and download them periodically from the server. SMTP usually is implemented to operate over Internet Port 25. Many mail servers now support extended simple mail transfer protocol, ISMP, which allows multimedia files to be delivered as email. Question number 16. Which of the following memory is non volatile? Option A. SRAM Option B DRAM Option C ROM Option D None of these The correct answer is Option C ROM RAM is referred to as volatile memory and is lost when the power is turned off whereas ROM is non-volatile and the contents are retained even after the power is switched off. RAM is called volatile because it is temporary memory. ROM is called non-volatile because it is permanent memory. Question number 17. Which of the following circuit is used as a memory device in computers? Option A. Rectifier. Option B. Flip-flop. Option C. Comparator. Option D. Attenuator. The correct answer is Option B. Flip-flop. A flip-flop or latch is a circuit that has two stable states and can be used to store state information as memory devices. Question number 18. The IC chip, used in computer, is made of Option A. Chromium. Option B. Iron oxide. Option C. Silica. Option D. Silicon. The correct answer is Option D. Silicon, an integrated circuit or monolithic integrated circuit, also referred to as an IC, a chip, or a microchip, is a set of electronic circuits on one small flat piece, or chip, of semiconductor material, normally silicon. Question number 19. AVI, Audio Video Interleave, format was developed by Option A. IBM. Option B. Apple. Option C. Microsoft. Option D. Macromedia. The correct answer is Option C. Microsoft. Audio Video Interleave. Also Audio Video Interleaved. 
known by its initials AVI, is a multimedia container format introduced by Microsoft in November 1992 as part of its video for Windows software. AVI files can contain both audio and video data in a file container that allows synchronous audio with video playback. Question number 20. A typical modern computer uses. Option A. Magnetic cores for secondary storage. Option B. LSI chips. Option C. Magnetic tape for primary memory. Option D. More than 10,000 vacuum tubes. The correct answer is Option B. LSI chips, large scale integration, LSI, is the process of integrating or embedding thousands of transistors on a single silicon semiconductor microchip. Thank you for watching the video. If you'd like practice this quiz then download the Wonderslate app now, link in the description below. If you have any suggestion for us feel free to leave comments. If you liked the video and want to see more of it hit the thumbs up and don't forget to click on subscribe button to get more updates of the future videos.